and a research team from Texas A&M Corpus Christi with the job of forecasting the future of COVID-19 for the area. They put out some new information today, that being in a presentation this afternoon, the team of Dr. Philippe Tissot and Dr. Chris Bird say new cases in the coastal bin appear to be slowing down and they attribute that to social distancing and the stay at home orders working, reducing the transmission ratio to below one, which of course is good news. We'd love to hear that, but they advise this is not a time to let your guard down. While there's a positive message here, I caution that just completely back to normal on April 30th um, without additional considerations or maybe uh, trading out uh, one intervention for another is still something that could end with a peak in the not too, different fu not too distant future with a lot of people contracting uh, the, the, the disease. The research shows if we go back to normal on April 30th, well, we could have up to 100,000 residents infected with the disease by June. That's a worst case scenario and up to 4,000 fatalities by August. According to the research, those numbers are much lower if the stay at home orders were to continue through August 31st.